Yo, WhatsApp virtual family, we finally returned. Today, we're watching some more dumb cheaters getting caught on camera. Yes, man. We were gone over the summer for a nice break, but now we're back to grinding and producing great content for y'all. Ah, oh, man, it feels amazing to be back. But guys, let's not waste any more of the amazing viewers' time and get started with the video. Wait, wait, thanks to TikTok Wolf for the compilation. And don't forget to get something to eat, have a seat, and enjoy the video. Okay, we're playing Never Ever Ever. Okay, Never Have I Ever Broken a Bone. Never have I ever made out with my friend's boyfriend. Can you explain? Okay, but he was flirting with me first. You're my friend. You shouldn't do that anyways. But just get out of the car. So we're just going to start things back up like this with the forbidden game of Never Have I Ever. Wow. Yep, and she's exposing her best friend with a TikTok. Honestly, what do you even do in this situation? I don't even know, man. And y'all saw how she put her finger down for her. Shit was hilarious. Ah ha ha ha. What I don't understand is what goes through y'all's minds when y'all hook up with your best friend's partner. How? But hey, at least she told her to just get out of the car at the end. Both her friend and her ex-boyfriend were in the wrong. Yo, Lana. So, um... What happened? Why you, got, why you playing both of us? Telling us the same exact thing, Alana. Why? Why are you doing us both wrong, Alana? This isn't right. You're telling us the same exact thing. You were with me last night, weren't you? We had sex last night, didn't we? We did? Okay. Neither of them give a fuck, Lil Bro. Look at the way they're both just smiling at him while he's recording, sounding like he's having a mental breakdown. Although she's wrong for cheating, I can't even be fully mad at just her. I don't even know why it's pissing me off that he's sitting there whining while they're laughing in his face. Probably because he should just end all connection with her right then and there. She obviously doesn't respect him or care for his emotions at all. He should just move on, keep grinding, and level up in life. I already did that. That's not fair. Or would you rather fuck my boyfriend and tell me you're at Tiffany's house? Turn it off. No. Turn it off. No. I'm serious. No. I already know. He told me. So. I told you what? He told me that you guys fucked. I already know. Well, the last thing that he told me was that you were just his fucking side bitch. Are you fucking kidding me? Get the fuck out. No. Get out. Are you serious right now? Are you serious? Who knew that there were more TikTok exposing game? This time it's a would you rather. Just insane, bruh. Bruh, if we in the car about to go get some to eat and one of y'all goofy goobers pull out y'all phone and ask to play either would you rather or never have I ever. I'm full sprinting out that fucking car, bro. Ha 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 ha. I ain't no goofy goober, Jack, but ain't no way her boyfriend came clean and exposed them for hooking up behind her back. That was crazy. Yeah, a lot of things were revealed to them that night. The fact that he called her his side chick is insane. Bruh, I can't claim this generation because ain't no way friends are crossing each each other now and hooking up with each other's partner. Never have I ever went to Chick fil A. Never have I ever uh, fucked Carly's boyfriend. Marius, are you fucking Get the fuck out of the car. We both are fucking you fucking kidding? Kidding? And we told you. You're fucking saving Bro, what the hell? There's been three of these TikToks where they expose their friend. And this one is the craziest one, man. There are four of them in the car now. That girl that slept with Carly's boyfriend can't show her face anymore. Yeah, the amount of embarrassment must have been unbearable. But they got a chill. Y'all saw how the girl in the back seat jumped on her right before the camera cut out? Ah, ha, ha, ha. I know you kiss boys in the locker room. What'd you say? I know you kiss boys in the locker room. Yes. Kiss boys in the locker room. Yes, I, people literally tell me all the time. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Fisher, I literally have proof. Do you kiss boys in the locker room? Yes or no? <laughs> no! I'm not gay! Are you sure? So, am I dating you for fun? Yes. So I don't love you? I don't... No, probably not. If you kiss boys in the locker room... Because I kissed a boy one time. I, See? You do <laughs> kiss them in the locker room! It was for... A dare. Okay, no, I, okay, no, I don't care. I'm I know okay. someone else actually said that you were actually kissing boys. In the and I do room. consistently? Yes, I literally have time. proof. I'll because I like it? it? I'll show you. Because yes, like yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I did not expect this shit. They got to give us a warning before showing us some like this. I know, right? Now I know wild things go on in the locker room. And you're never supposed to spill the beans on what does. But why was he kissing other dudes in there? Uh huh, huh, huh. I play football and I remember that last year our star running back was running around the locker room naked and trolling everybody. Shit was so funny. Now y'all are actually crazy for that, Jack. But anyway, bro tried to cover it up saying that it was a dare. Cap, they would have told her that he was dared to do that shit and laughed about it. Bro really thought he was slick. Ah ha ha ha. He took International Friendship Day too seriously and that was on July 30th. You guys want to play Two Truths and a Lie? Yeah, sure. Um, okay, so my dog, his name's Molson. I have blonde hair and Alahi fucking slept with my boyfriend. 
You told me you wouldn't tell what me. What the fuck did you expect you from me? You slept with my friend. boyfriend of six months. She's my, you can't get mad at me for I this. expect you to keep your mouth shut. Yeah, but like Bro, there's just no fucking way. This must be a compilation only of people exposing their friends sleeping with their partners on TikTok. Liam, why do you always have to do this, bro? Always fucking up when you pick the compilation for us to watch. Ah ha 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 ha. Stop laughing at me, Lucas. How was I supposed to know what clips we would be reacting to? I don't watch the full compilation because it spoils it for me. Yeah, that actually makes sense. But anyway, we found another game. Two truths and a lie. Ah ha ha ha. LOL. What's next? They're gonna be playing Duck Duck Goose and pick the person who slept with their boyfriend? Oh my gosh, he's gonna be, he's gonna be Are you gonna do this? Okay, I'm, I'm gonna... Shoot. Hi, sir. Wowzers, man. Imagine the coincidence of pulling up to Starbucks and leaving with your balls freezing in your pants. Ah ha ha ha. Man, shut your Flintstones head ass up, Liam. Bruh really said wowzers, but besides that, the camera woman really gave her a mini pep talk saying, are you gonna do this? Ah ha ha ha. I don't know, man. Something about this just seems fake, but hey, if it is real, why the hell are the other employees just sitting around there like nothing's happened? LOL, is this sort of shit a regular occurrence at their Starbucks? Yeah, I just know this ain't allowed. And hopefully she was fired because she allowed her emotions to take control. You watching the video, how about you tell us the craziest experience you ever had at a Starbucks? And while you're down there, go ahead and like and subscribe if you haven't already, and enjoy the video so far. Right here. Cheat it. No. Look at this shit, bro. Straight up caught you cheating on me, bro. Look at this shit. Chill. What do you mean? You, I caught you cheating on me. Hey. Chill. What? What do you got to say? What do you got to say? What do you got to say? You've been cheating on me this whole time. Oh yeah, I'm looking at that shit, looking at these niggas' living conditions, bro. I see why she cheated on you. The house dirty as shit, the mattress on the floor, clothes and shit everywhere. I like how the other dude didn't say a word and just got his shit and left. Ain't really nothing else you could do. And I agree with you, Lucas. What did he truly expect if he didn't even have his shit together? At least keep the crib clean. Yeah, I agree as well. The guy recording just needs to chill and have her pack her shit up and leave. He shouldn't keep yelling and getting louder, because that'll happen the more he thinks about it, and the longer she's there. Guys, in order to stop your girl from even thinking about cheating on you would be to build up a massive amount of respect and have her obsessed with you. Then she won't cheat, even if she knew you would never find out. Bro, this shit is just crazy. If you want to have your fun and mess around with other people, do not commit to a relationship. Facts, bro, and to you, the viewer watching this, we appreciate you actually making it to the final seconds of the video. You're in the top 1% of people, and we can tell that your dopamine systems are not corrupted. Since you made it all the way here, go ahead and subscribe if you enjoyed and want to become a part of the virtual family. Yeah, and the best way to support us right now is to watch another one of our videos. And to help you with that, we suggest you witness men finally stop simping and entitled women get rejected. It just popped up on the screen for you to click, so go watch that now. Say what's up to us when you get there, and we can't wait to see you. Peace.